back with another, another reaction. reaction. I'm Kel. I'm so Squad Reaction. Yeah. Welcome back to our channel. And your first time here, welcome, baby. So feel like the people know we react. We're on episode 17 of Tokyo Ghoul season three. I'm excited, y'all. Tokyo Ghoul season three episode yes. 17. You heard the ladies. A lot of crazy stuff been going on. We just can't wait to get to the finale. Basically, everybody is fighting. <laughs> Most weird. Master Sue came out of nowhere. He mm -hmm. fighting. Um, what's that? Uh, who? I'm so bad with their names. Which one? The guy in the lab that's fighting. Keep oh, the that daddy. Girl, the keep daddy. calling that girl ugly. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait. Let's see what happened, y'all. Sophia got purple here today matching my shirt. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. It's Kaneki. What are you doing with the white hair? I thought it turned back. No, it turned back white. Remember when he's fighting that dude Arima? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So he was the one I king. And then he killed himself. <laughs> he was the one I king? Mm -hmm. Wow. Someone said in the comments that Kaneki thought he was the one I king, but mm -hmm. he wasn't. Oh, yeah, yeah, he did thought he was. Yeah. He was too short. I mean, he is the one eye, but he's not the king. This hair went from curly to straight. <laughs> it's straight now. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. And those two, they did. Oh, he back at the coffee shop. Oh, they brought him home. And my boy. Hey, Kim. And Toka. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. She's so pretty now. Coffee? That's how back home, huh? Mm hmm Plus, S, 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 plus, and S. I can make special investigator in no time. They added her to the group. Stop tallying up their <laughs> That's the girl with the black hair. You just trust anybody, huh? <laughs> You're a ghoul when you trust you. Whoa, what is this? What the hell are these doves doing here? We're here to protect Kaneki, not to start a fight. We won't make trouble. We came to fulfill Kisho's dying wish. They aren't our enemies. They might not be yours. What kind of meeting is this? What business does the staff of a coffee shop have with the remnants of Algiri Tree? Whatever. As long as I get to kill Dr. Connor. <laughs> they still didn't kill that man. Look, Kaneki, when Rushima fell, your people came and they saved my life. So I'll hear you out at least. What is it you're after? My goal is aligned with the wishes of the last one eyed king. I want ghouls and humans to come to an understanding. Anyway, there's a part y'all laugh. Nah. <laughs> I'm about to, about to laugh at this man. I expected something foolish, yet I'm still surprised. So, how do you plan to bring about peace between humans? She's not even a ghoul. We'll talk about you. <laughs> you out of your mind. The reason that we've been killing each other for so long is because no one's tried to compromise. Our peoples can coexist. As a ghoul who was once human, I'm living proof. The key is that we start a dialogue. You watch him. But I doubt they'll come mm. to the table just like that. So You're right. we'll force them into a situation where they have Listen to listen to my man's speech. Right here. You know he deep. I declare the founding of an organization, one dedicated to this cause. As in this group's name, I'll call it GOAT. Call it GOAT? GOAT. The greatest of all time, baby. Oh, she out too? She ain't nobody. Take here to go. I fought your boss. He killed my sister. <laughs> She's Toka and Ayato's mom. They loved her as I did. I'm being told now that he was sympathetic to ghouls. Yet if he were standing in front of me, I'm sure I would still want to kill him. Everyone around that guy worked their butts off in the hopes that he might toss a cow's cock. Who the hell is here you go? <laughs> that happens to be the reason I'm here now. I've wanted him to acknowledge me for a long time. 
He shall audit my stead. You're free to hold on to your grudge, but you'll never get another chance to act on it. <laughs> and doing so wouldn't bring your sister back, Renji Yomo. We believe in the successor Kisho chose for himself. And you believe in a person called Ken Kaneki. <laughs> Isn't that enough for now? Remember the goal here. We can reach an understanding without having to agree. Not on everything. Well, in that case, it's doable. Talk it! Turn on the TV! We got like three new characters. I know. <laughs> this is live footage from the 22nd Ward. The local CCG has a lot of things. They had dropped. You know, get a break. Civil reports are coming in from neighboring. It's probably those white jackets. <laughs> First they killed the washers, now they're up to the bureaus. Mm -hmm. It looks like they aim to clean out the whole organization in conjunction with the appearance of the One-Eyed King. I see. So this is how our enemy works. <laughs> she has a hell of a fever. Okay. Won't that get infected? Damn. No, I mean, Wait, is that girl? Really that girl? Um, yeah, that lady. Yeah, that's that lady. There has to be someone Damn. who can help her! Oh, I can't help her! Oh, I hate it. Here. Nico, how you get here? He's the one with um, Jason. Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. Roma sent out a little SOS and I picked it up. Check it out. A cognate word. That's nasty. Did you come here to save Roma? Oh, I'm sure she'll be all right. I just thought I would stop by and make eyes at your new kid. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. So about this woman. Do you want her to die, or are you implying that you could help us fix her up? Not a chance. That said, I do know of a way. A way? Yeah, and it's very simple. You should take her to see a doctor. Oh my god. Damn. Like, ever heard a knocking on the door? <laughs> what is this problem? Oh, he just oh, found out about this. <laughs> so I take it that you're not interested in becoming part of the GOAT. After all these years. You think we team up with the shit sack that killed him? Man, boss? shut up. It was so either he'd get killed or he'd get killed. Stop. Jason wasn't that. Okay. Jason was um, torturing him. Mm -hmm. Mutual respect. The way we do it in the 13th ward is simple. Get your ass out of here. <laughs> Jason would have killed him. Exactly. He probably would have liked that. Mag and Khan can defend himself. Yeah. Interfering would be an insult to the boss. Just watch. Give me Khan the boss now. <laughs> You're not even in the same league as Yamari. Of course He's not. He was a guy. Who's that? Let me get my Khan King. We need to get a straight outfit change that quick. Heck yes. Or maybe he just took his shirt off, his jacket off. Oh, no, he ain't. He did a little twist leg thing here. And that's it. That's all he had to do to take him down. Pathetic. That's the boss's cock and I don't care what he got to say. I was not going to let Jason kill him. Mm -hmm. Or the leader of the white suits. Naki. Yo, that outfit is safe. So. Your leadership. I don't want them without you. Fight for me. And I'll fight for your sakes, too. You're not any friends now? They wow. Word is they're an underground human outfit that supports ghouls. I'm lucky they're popping. They take supply, right? I don't think it's that inconceivable. Chakana keep on a career group. See, um, flying pigs have a you bring girls and humans together, basically. So you want humans and groups in his group. Yeah. You want everybody to work I'm together. Of the great yeah. Ha, he always trying to do something. I'll tell you that. <laughs> oh, she might be all right. I hope they ain't gonna make a ghoul. What's the Great Wheel Act really? As the world stands, one's fate as citizen or pariah, predator or prey, is decided from birth. But if we can dispel that standard, perhaps both 
sides will realize they have a choice. Such a paradigm shift is our group's objective. Ain't nobody gonna listen to me. These ideas were first put forth by a medical student, one who since turned her attention towards the treatment of ghouls. From what I've been told, this woman was once in love with a ghoul. Oh, that's, mm. um, that's his girl, his girlfriend. <laughs> well, I thought it was um, Tolkien's mom. We will continue to assist what ghouls we can in secret. Just as we'll continue to hope that ghouls' rights are established in this society. So count us as allies. Oh, look. And of his girlfriend doing stuff. So she would have trying to make a change too, huh? Mm -hmm. What is their group's founder? What it sounds like? I want some coffee. What's the name of that group? A group of prey. Mm. So she's trying to bring ghouls and um, humans together too, because she's in love with a ghoul. Who that? That's the chick, the blonde chick. Oh, the cop? Yeah. Oh. Well, yeah, I'm love. so glad you're okay. And who in the hell are you? Mm. The one that's been guarding your body. I was asleep without a care while all this was going on around me. You were wounded. I'm guessing she kicked out the floor soon now. <laughs> Oh my god, what's her problem, bro? She don't mind though a lot, right? I mean, she's strong. Yeah, she's strong. That's not right. Time to talk. Uh, what are you doing out here? You know that's it's a story. strange thing. All these people who have tried their you? damnedest to kill each other are now standing as allies. That's true for most of us. But when it comes to you, at least, I never felt like you wanted me dead. What you did really came as a shock to me. Mm -hmm. I was completely at your mercy spared my life. Eye patch. He's still this there. world has an understanding <laughs> of ghouls. They eat humans, so they will do whatever I judge to be right. Man, I knew my dude wasn't dead. I'm like, it's no way. You know, nobody. Did it say die to combat, combat the end? <laughs> if a friend or an acquaintance you thought you'd lost were to suddenly come back in your how do you think you would feel? If it were me, I think I'd be scared. Scared of what? I'd be scared that they might go away again. Actually, you might have a point. <laughs> the cat. Hey. <laughs> he got a cat. It's been a while. You brought my cat. <laughs> okay. Through the window. So breaking and entering. <laughs> How far you fallen? To think that an upright investigator would wait. That's warmer for us both. <laughs> they not investigate. First off, allow me to apologize. That's something he liked over. No, he always just had me. <laughs> it's been years. I was finally coming to terms with the fact that you were dead. So what am I supposed to say at this point? I don't need your apologies. I'm not happy with you, but I'm not upset either. Yeah, yeah. What I am is very confused. Sorry, former investigator mama. Don't be. It's fine. I'll be staying here for a while at least. Waiting for a bath. I'll be waiting. Girl, cause ain't nothing else going on. <laughs> exactly, just forgive and let it go. Bossy a cat. Akira Mano, right? What's up with the woman? Are you feeling better? She even know her better. Let's stay late. Oh, she gonna tell her that she killed her dad? <laughs> oh yeah. She ain't mean, so he shot to kill her. For real. <laughs> That's a hell of a thing to get someone up from their sick bed to tell them. <laughs> I'm glad you're such a tactless bitch. I'll be able to despise you openly. That's fair. 
Yo, the old token with a fight in the head. <laughs> Children. They're ghouls. Children that have been staying with our giddy tree. I mean, either she killed her father, he killed her. Exactly. They had to grow up alone. Hey, Toka. Hear me. Glad you came by. She older now, but she's still like she's like a baby, right? Mm -hmm. She is that. She all shouting. Mm -hmm. like, she all right? Just do it. Whoa, wait. Why didn't I no stay here? Last thing I'll say. I've known Hinami for a long time now. And she has never held any kind of grudge against her father. It's true. Come here, you little devils. Get her! <laughs> <laughs> I do go. Where were you? I felt like coffee. Mm -hmm. Hey, listen, kids. Why don't you give this lady here a big squeeze, too? Mm. Yeah, sure. Do you mind? <laughs> At least they is. Knock yourselves out. Oh. She smells good. Hey, do you want to play, too? Oh, that's so cute. Hey, that'd be funny if they hope. No, they are not need Give her a hug. My girl all grown up. Right. Active. Is that her fault? Her, her mom got killed. Active. Stupid. Father killed both her parents. Yeah, that's a shame though. I think her daddy was the doctor, right? Yeah, the doctor. Now you want revenge for your father, but your father's out here killing a lot of people. I know he's killing ghouls, but mm -hmm. but some people that work for the CDC is fucking is damn ghouls. Exactly, dog. Who shoot? He didn't. He didn't. He didn't know that. Mm -mm. <laughs> Surprisingly, not. Or did he care? <laughs> mm -hmm. There's no your father didn't get killed for no reason, baby. Exactly. Yeah, Alright guys, that's in the episode. It brought tears to my eyes. Sad. Mm -hmm. It's a lot going on. So what what you think about it? About which part? The ending right there. About, you know, <laughs> model daughter I think, wanna revenge, but I think she has nobody to hate because at the end of the day, model killed her parents and her parent and she just lived on without regretting anybody. Exactly. Because when Toko killed um, her father, motto, she said, stop it. So she's the one to actually stop it. Mm hmm Because if he wasn't trying to attack the little girl, mm -hmm. 
he would never, she would never talk with her. Where I killed him. Exactly. So basically, in a way, he put it on himself. Mm -hmm. It's sad that she model lost her father, but it's in the day he was out there killing goose. Like he, he just had like, what was his reason to kill him? Cause they killed his wife. Remember? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. But so, they not the one that killed his wife. Yeah, so it's like it's like the hatred is going back and forth. So nobody is in the wrong. Whoever killed your wife, you have to kill him. It's like everybody just want revenge. Mm -hmm. Like and it gets out of hand. It's like a it's like a what's your a part? cycle. A cycle, basically mm -hmm. a cycle. Like everybody just want revenge. Boom, like you killed my father or he killed your mama. It's like yeah. everybody is out there for revenge. And the hatred will never leave. That's why I kind of keep trying to bring the humans and ghouls together because they're still the same people. So they can get a better understanding of what's going on. That's mm -hmm. why Toka was showing her the kids and telling her the story. Mm -hmm. Basically, if we don't stop this, we're going to continue the cycle over and over. Exactly. Okay. I killed your father, but your father killed her, her parents. Yeah, her parents. And he was about to kill her too. Mm -hmm. but so I saved her. And your father hated ghouls because he killed your mother. So it's like... That cycle starts that all over. That didn't stop. Like Kaneki said, once the ghouls and the humans come together, it probably could end a cycle of them killing each mm -hmm. other. They yeah. become a family. Understand one another. Yeah. Cause like the doctor said, like ghouls are born ghouls and humans are born humans, so they have no right to hate each other. That's mm -hmm. just how they was born. Mm -hmm. well, a lot of times the humans don't like the ghouls because they feel like they kill them and just want to eat them. Mm -hmm. So I can understand where the humans coming from. But they got to eat to live, so. And the humans got to eat to live, too. But they could have did like with the... The old man was doing like eating the dead bodies. And yeah, stuff. cause it always somebody committing suicide. Mm -hmm. Or oh, cause they mostly just need the blood, right? They need the blood and yeah. the organs. Yeah, the organs. Yeah. yeah. So like, I'm glad Connie keep met the old man before <laughs> meeting anybody else crazy. Yeah. Like, be crazier. Mm -hmm. So we gotta see how they gonna make this work because ghouls gotta eat humans to survive cause they love their meat. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So we gotta see. Cause that's mostly the bit. I think that the humans just have a lot of fear. That's mm -hmm. why they don't want to come together with the ghouls because they have fear that the ghoul might eat them. Exactly. Like, I'm best friends with a ghoul. I don't know one day he or she might get the herbs in their spinner and they spend the night and bite the shit, bite me. <laughs> but you got to remember, um, the old boy, his girlfriend's a human. Mm -hmm. So they kind of work it out. You got you to gotta figure out. But she, she, she still be letting him bite on her. Yeah. Here and there. Because she like it, right? <laughs> What about like a Google? I don't want them biting on me. Well, I guess we just gotta work it out somehow. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to see how this come together gonna work. Mm -hmm. Other than that, y'all just in this reaction. Don't forget to leave a like, comment down, down below. below. I'm Kel. I'm Sophia, the KSR reaction channel. channel. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. Actually, what? What? Subscribe to the, the channel. channel. Yeah. I don't know where Sophia hair was at. Really. I don't, we don't know say that part. <laughs> but yeah, make sure you subscribe, hit the like bell, cop button, and comment down below for more Tokyo Cool reactions. Right, peace.